Hey everyone, Paolo here. So welcome back to just another dang how-to channel where I share how to videos about Mac tips, web, Swift, Salesforce, and game development. On this video, I'm going to share tips on how to package your Unreal Engine app for testing in an iOS device. I'll break down the basics of provisioning profiles and certificates to better understand the concepts, which will help us in troubleshooting some errors when we're building and packaging uh, the app. Uh, you would want to test your app first in a real iOS device before you send it to Apple for submission to the Apple App Store or have your beta testers test your app. In order to install any uh, iOS app in a uh, device like an iPhone or iPad, the app bundle first needs to be signed by Apple. So how is this done so what we would need is what's called a provisioning profile so from apple definition it's a collection of digital entities that uniquely ties the developer and devices to an authorized iphone development team and enables the device to be used for testing so in theory your provisioning profile should contain an app id contain a certificate and it should contain a device so the app ID is simply the bundle identifier for your app. So this structure is reverse, um, reverse domain. Um, certificates, you could have uh, certificates for development or for distribution. So for development, this is the part where I'm going to uh, talk in this series, which would allow you to install it on your own device. On the device level, so you could have multiple could register you could register your iphone your ipad your mac to get started first head over to developer.apple.com go under accounts click on certificate identifiers and profiles under certificates uh, you can see i have two certificates here both are for distribution we're going to create one which is for development so click on the plus icon here and under options here select apple development and click continue so it's going to ask you to upload a certificate signing request so we don't have one i'm going to show you how to create one so open up your keychain access and from here you can see i don't have any active certificates I'll go under keychain and select certificate assistant and select request a certificate from a certificate authority under that, uh, fill in the user email address, the common name. I'm going to change this to my company name. And fill in the CA email address. Uh, choose save to this and click continue. Save it on my desktop. Done. Go back to uh, Apple. Uh, click on choose file and select that certificate and click on upload and click continue. Now I've created a certificate. I need to download and install it so it could get added in my keychain. So let me open that up. Just double click on it and it will get added to the key to your keychain. Next, let's create the app ID. So under identifiers, click on this plus thing and for app for any of this option just select app id and select app we're creating an app give it a description say ue5 demo this is the reverse uh, domain so select concept and ue5 demo uh, just select the defaults for the options below unless you have something built specific to your app. Uh, click on register and now you have an app ID. Uh, next for the devices, this is pretty straightforward. Uh, go ahead and click plus here and then add your device and add the device UD ID. So if you don't know your device ID, connect your phone to your Mac and go under finder. And under there, uh, you could uh, click on your uh, header here, and it would show you the UDID. 
So I already registered my device, so I won't do that again. Um, go under Profiles. And this time, let's create that provision profile. So under here, click on Plus and choose iOS App Development and click Continue. Uh, it's going to ask you which app ID uh, this provision profile is for. So select the one that we just created that we're going to use for Unreal Engine. Click continue. Uh, this is the certificate. Click yes. Click continue. Which device? And select your iPhone. Uh, your device, which is my iPhone. I'm going to give it a name. I'm going to say UE5 demo and generate. Now I could download this. So I downloaded it on my downloads. Now let's head over to um, the launcher. Cool. And open it up. So you'll, now you could um, start with your own project. Um, so there's an option here that I want to show you, which is for um, target platform. So I tried it both for desktop and for mobile. So it doesn't really matter. Um, just going to select my first person and say UE5 demo and create a project. Cool. So this is the template. Um, go under edit and go under project settings. Let me move that here and scroll at the bottom here under platforms, go under iOS and in this section is going to start gathering some information about your machine. Uh, so it detected a bunch of stuff here, which we don't really need. So I'm going to click on import here. I'm going to go to my downloads and look for that um, provisioning that I just created. I believe it's this one. No, this was created yesterday. Uh, this one, which is just created today. Cool. So I'm going to select that. I'm going to select this uh, certificate and for the name, project name, give it a name, UE5 demo, UE5 demo. For the bundle identifier, this is the part where it should exactly match uh, what you wrote in for the app ID. So that's all you need. Um, scroll down a little bit at the bottom. Some that I saw has the automatic signing check. So make sure that it's false. There's no iOS team ID in there. And you could close out this configuration. And on Unreal Engine 5, the uh, build is now under this platform UI. So because I have my phone connected, uh, I detected it. I can click on build on my phone. You could click on the show output log to see how the status is for um, installing the app on your phone. So this may take a couple of minutes after this is done. If it, everything is good, you will see the build was successful. If you get an error, um, make sure that you your configurations are right and you selected the right provisioning profile, the right certificate, and you have the right uh, bundle ID. Cool. So the build was successful. Now let's open up the device. And you would see I now have Unreal Engine there.
and there you have your game. Those are the steps on how to install your Unreal Engine app on your iPhone. So hope you like this tip. If you have questions or you're stuck into something, please hit the comments section below. Cheers. Bye for now. See you on the next one.